Mani Padme Hum Mum Mani Padme Hum Mum Mani Padme Hum From Isis Channelings Descent into the cauldron of death and transformation with all outer planets in retrograde and Venus all set to finally enter the underworld, cave, hermit mode, is the order of the day. Venus, Inanna, is at the end of her journey as morning star in this particular shamanic cycle of death and rebirth as the Capricorn, the crone, wise woman, meta-goddess, and is beginning to retreat from the early morning sky, no longer visible above the horizon as she descends into the cauldron of transformation in the underworld, though I can still see her twinkling very low on the horizon, as the timing of her descent differs according to latitude. As Venus Anana is the embodiment of the Divine Feminine, her journey is reflected in our individual journey, and right now we find ourselves in a serpentine spiral of descent into the labyrinth of the womb, tomb, cave, of the underworld, the domain of death and transformation. This is the realm of death of the old ego identities, false perceptions and distortions, patterns and ways of being that no longer serve, where Venus Inanna meets her shadow self, twin sister, Eresh Kagal, absolutely naked and vulnerable, after being disrobed of all her vestments, false titles, armory, walls at the seven gates of descent. We are in the realm of the wise crone, cooking, simmering, and Kiridwin's cauldron of transformation and rebirth, at Hecate's liminal gates of consciousness, at Nekbet's gateway of initiation into ancient wisdom. Cave hermit time can be deceptive because outwardly there seems to be little action, but the swirlings of the unconsciousness are bringing deep insights and revelations. Stillness and receptivity are required to listen to the new nuggets of information. Air chakras and sonic sounds are doing a crazy tango, and then take guided action. A redirection is in motion, directing your new rebirth resurrection. In multiple sessions of initiations, I've witnessed my clients being directed to underground cave labyrinths underneath temples, pyramids as part of our shamanic journey of initiation. All ancient temples of learning initiations into the mysteries were located above a labyrinth network of underground caves where the initiate was put through a series of tests in order to be initiated into the higher spirals of awareness, consciousness, and mastery. As we wade into the labyrinth of Capricorn Metagoddess, Grandmother Spider's Web of Creations, we are being initiated into the new foundations of interconnectedness that need to be established if we are to usher in a new golden age. The thread of interconnectedness of Grandmother Spider's Web connects all three realms, heaven, earth, underworld, conscious, subconscious, superconsciousness, man, animal, plants, intention, action, manifestation. It is said that the golden age will return when the crones are once again honored and recognized as the backbones, foundations of civilizations, for they are the sovereign keepers, midwives of the sacred wisdom that harness the magic of the elements and unite the natural world. We are being stirred in the cauldron of death and rebirth by the crone, wise woman, grandmother spider, Capricorn metagoddess. Ancient wisdom is being imparted to you, so that you may emerge as the co-creator of the new age where spirit flows and interconnects all as one. Listen to your body. Take time off social media. Retreat, sleep, connect with nature. Where have you neglected, dishonored, or not fully committed to the natural world and your connection to it? Where are you being redirected? What loose ends are you being guided to tie up? And light and grace and joy be the change you want to see. Sake na from isischannelings.wordpress.com Follow our full transmissions at primedisclosure.com